just like to say, lad, today we're going to go through the correct use of a wool hook and the do's and don'ts in, in uh, how to use a wool hook and how not to use a wool hook. Um, first of all, I'd say the um, most crucial thing with a wool hook is to have your hooks sharp. So a blunt wool hook is more likely not to go into a bale and, and is probably just as likely not to come out of a bale easier. So the first thing you should do is get yourself a file, get the grinder, and make sure you've got your wool hook sharp. If they're sharp, they'll actually pull straight into the bale. You don't actually have to hit them in. They'll sink themselves into the bale themselves. Um, the other thing is how you hold a wool hook. Um, probably the incorrect way to hold a wool hook is right in the centre. Because as you see, when you've got the wool hook held in the centre, you've got very little control on it. So if you're going to hold a wool hook, you hold the wool hook to the corner, i.e. if it's in your right hand, you hold it to the right corner. If it's in the left hand, you hold it to the left horn, and you've got far more control with the hook. 